start talking. The rules are not subject to negotiation. Shut up! Define the rules, and there will be consequences. Examples will be made. On your knees. Keep still. This will be the plague with which the Lord shall strike all men. We are all that's left of a city beyond redemption, fulfilling our sacred duty to free the souls of the damned. Good to go up here! Mindset. That should hold. Father, forgive us. We shed this blood in the name of mercy. She's here!
Dying Light 2 features a functioning ecosystem that reacts on multiple levels to the things you do and the choices you make. In the example we're about to show you, our protagonist undertakes a mission for the Peacekeepers, one of the many factions active in the city. They want you to negotiate with two survivors who are controlling and hoarding a water supply. Are you going to insult us with another final offer? Let's say you choose to carry out the Peacekeepers' orders, one way or another. After this, you'll start seeing a significant change in the city as access to the water supply has allowed the peacekeepers to bring stability and develop the area. There's even running water for the people at street level. And that raises their morale and allows you to replenish your energy on the go. But there's a cost to this. The PKs have a rigid approach to law and order. So while the streets may be safer, it's only safe for those who side with them. So if you get on their bad side... Now let's return to that moment of choice. And instead of killing them, you choose to team up with this group to supply water in the black market. As you will see, this creates a very different set of consequences for the city. With water being a precious currency, it brings you access to new resources and trade. But this, in turn, attracts the worst type of people to the area. And this is just a single decision, one out of hundreds you'll have to make. Boozer have a run-in with R.I.P. the last couple of days? Why? One of my men escaped to Ripper Camp, got tortured, like they always do. But this time they kept asking me if he knew about it. Two bikers, two men. The Ripper called them mongrels. You ask me? You got a price on your head. No same as me. Anything that happens here is far better than what's going on out there. Perfect.
Chin up there, sport. Monitor your environment for anything out of the ordinary. The home of tomorrow may undergo certain challenges. After a crisis, work with your neighbors to ensure success. There's no I in nuclear wasteland. Document your adventures. Your memories will shape the new American dream. What's that sound? Begin by inquiring with the locals. Gently coax them into cooperation. Use a little elbow grease if you have to. Родной подлетаем в земле, Вся команда села, и машина пришла На честном слове и на одном крыле. Команда цела, и машина пришла На честном слове и на одном крыле. were gone in the blink of an eye. Tribes rose up. Alliances formed. Territory was conquered. There was no one left alive to tell you no. And in this wild, wide open place, if you wanted something bad enough, it was yours for the taking. You see, in a world where there are no rules, Insanity rules.
Uh, Professor, you have five seconds to leave the premises. Five. With Artyom and the Spartans a considerable distance from Moscow, they will start to discover how radiation has affected different life forms across the country. Humanimals are a new mutant to Exodus, fierce and unrelenting. The A-Shot serves as an effective close-range weapon for this frantic, breathless type of gameplay, a marked distinction from more tactically demanding human encounters. Everything in Exodus is built on real-life lighting, materials and physics. A knife thrown into enemy armor may not penetrate deeply enough to kill them. Just like you can extinguish lamps, shooting them will cause them to explode and a fire to spread. As a player, you will need to hone both your aim and tactics in order to successfully navigate your way through the game. This was just one brief stop on an epic journey across post-apocalyptic Russia. Metro Exodus offers a world of stunningly rich environments to traverse and explore, new and overhauled gameplay mechanics and unsurpassed attention to detail. For fans of the series and newcomers alike, the gripping next chapter in Artyom's story promises countless hours of tense and exciting exploration ahead.
Chang. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. The time full fast forwards whatever it touches. But it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges. Sam, what's your status? Corellium density is still increasing. My status is fucked. There's tons of them. Can you sit out the rain? No. They're closing in on my position. I have to move before they realize I'm in here. Sam, if one of those things eats you, it'll trigger a void out. You'll come back, sure. But the surrounding area will still be a crater. I got an idea. Come <laughs> on. 
probably to take a trophy. They've spotted us. We need to get away. And while child, you can easily be killed, even by the weakest humans. We're trapped on this bridge. There's an escape route. Okay, I think we're safe. As you move around the caves and tunnels that these creatures inhabit, you'll see what humans have done to your kind over the years. So that's the world through the eyes of a young creature, running away from even the weakest human. Now we're going to go forward in time and see the world through the eyes of a larger, more powerful adolescent creature and see what they're capable of doing. <laughs>